back to a brand new video. Today we're going to be playing another Hitman video. No surprise. This is part 9. This video was obviously part 8. So it's actually pretty, the first bit pretty easy, pretty simple to do. So just literally follow what, exactly what I do. And you should be pretty cool. So you just want to do exactly what you do there. You don't even need to sneak or anything, you just walk straight through. And it's extremely easy. Extremely easy. It's just but this bit, this is probably the only hard bit, in my opinion. So that guy there, you just need to hide around here. It's actually pretty pretty simple. Wait for him to turn around, then we can go extremely close. Go wait for these two guys to finish talking. Once they have finished talking, we can go through and do our second objective. We will not be coming out of any of the second exits. There's two there's three exits. Two windows on either side, and there's a door. We won't Just be able using the door or the window on the either side. We'll be using the window that we went through. So yeah, that's why we can't be yeah. careful. They got the old security cam control room up and running. You kidding? So now we can go through because the guy's now walked away. It is. So, so we to go in and press the button. Work. Yeah. See you later. And then you literally go straight out and go to the building straight ahead of us. You shouldn't get spotted by. This guy to our right, which was in the building we just were in. He'll see us a bit, but he doesn't have a clue what's going on. There might be a guy to our left. No, he's not there anymore, so it's okay. There might also there's this guy, which is quite difficult to get past, but as long as you have pick up this wrench, we're good, which you find in the building where you've disabled the second security cameras. And he just walks over to there. And we have just enough time to get past him, get into this building, and Bob's your uncle. We have done it. We have freaking done it. So you sneak past this guy and go into this area right here. We don't even need to take him down because he goes to the best place ever to get past him. He goes into the doorway and faces the wrong way. Just to make sure he doesn't turn around, you want to hide behind most of the walls, see? Leans against the wall, doesn't have a clue what's going on. There you go, we did it. Silent Assassin. I am proud of that. So this bit's also quite easy. It even gives you the most biggest idea. You want to sabotage this. So the electric goes off. And then we go... we go and hide in this. Pretty simple. Once this guy has come up to us, we can then sneak past him as quickly and quietly as possible. Quickly as quietly as possible. Got it. So this guy to our left will literally, will literally not even look at us, so we don't even need to look at him. The only struggle is this guy here. Shoot. Something needs to fix it here. Here's the only struggle. So once we, we need to get the key card potentially. So we can we can still sneak down and get it, even though we forgot. Still sneak down. We didn't even get spotted as well. So that's how freaking good Alpha we did. Checking in. No sign that's how of good it. we did. There's also kind of a secret weapon up here. I thought I found something there, but there. There is also kind of a secret weapon up here. It's called the. It's pretty much the AK 740 from like Call of Duty and other gun games. It's the AH 740U. Uh, I won't cast it as a full secret weapon, but it's, it's a bit of a secret weapon. It's useful as well. So, go through here and we get our cutscene. Hello. 
little bit of a cutscene. So there was actually a cut there, I absolutely full on failed. So I just had to make sure how to do it, but I finally did it. Enjoy. I tried making the editing as good as possible, but there's no other way of getting past that without taking any guy, that guy out. Because he's hidden, we got all our points back and we go exactly off the next tip. Although 79 plus 140 isn't zero, it's pretty much 70. Badass, I know. Don't you worry about me looking badass. So he definitely won't see us. He's easy to get around. We'll just follow him all the way down, obviously, wait for him. Follow him all the way down. He, he gets past you. And you just want to walk to a wall. There's two guys down there. I don't know why, because when I've done it once, there's only been one guy. But you go hide around this corner because they don't come this far. So um, once this guy comes up here, we'll try and make our move and get through the gate without being spotted. See? If I was, if I knew there was someone looking for me, I would look at every single corner. But this guy just sits there and have a cigarette. Sits there and has a cigarette. Cigarette. It's a cigarette. Oh, wow! We're spinning still. See, that guy on the bridge is probably the hardest one to get past. This one here, by us, doesn't even know what's going on. He hasn't got a clue. He hasn't got a freaking clue. We're gonna make our move. And if we can, can we make our move? If he goes through that door, we can make a move. If he, he, the person on the bridge looks left, we can make a move. Make a move. I think we can make a move. Maybe, maybe he'll face left as well as the other guy. Just maybe. Oh yes, he did. So now we can go down with him because they're gonna be there for hours. We can just climb down here go along and we've done it we've freaking done it as long as he doesn't see us right we've got we're good we're good we're good we're good see there's obviously multiple routes to get past these guys I think there must be but I chose this route because could do it this way so what's what's the point in not doing it if you can't do it so um there's a checkpoint down here and this is quite a long mission so i'm going to end it here thanks for watching please sure to rate comment subscribe and bye bye right have you checked sector two hang on <laughs>